my loves and welcome back. Today I'm coming to you guys with my Ipsy Glam Bag Unbagging. Now I've had this bag for well over a week, almost two weeks I want to say, and I'm sorry for not making a video. It, I just started working and I'm just trying to get back into the flow of things, so unacceptable. I know. Okay, so we're just gonna get to the unbagging. I haven't opened what's in the bag, but something did come out of the bag, so of course I know what that is. But this one's called the Beauty Candy. It has a quilted effect to the bag. It's really cute. I like the color, and I normally like the Ipsy bags. Now, the first thing I see here um, is a pretty generous sample of Rogue by Rihanna. Now, of course I smelled it, I got excited because I'm always looking for new perfumes and I, I just, ugh, how do I describe this? I describe this scent as the scent I would wear when my hopes and dreams die out and rot. I just don't like the smell of it, it, oh, it kind of made me nauseous. I sprayed it on my wrist, um, you know, everyone's chemistry is different. So if you like this perfume, do you boo? I don't. I think it's disgusting. Um, it's a very generous sample. Um, but yeah, no, like I said, it's like death warmed over. Here you go, Rihanna. No, I wasn't impressed. So I hope whatever's in this bag is a lot better. Okay, so the first thing I spotted was a Starlux lip gloss called Guilty Pleasure. I want to swatch it. Now, I've received some Starlux product before. I think last year I um, unboxed one of their uh, monthly boxes. And they have really decent product. So it's not a bad company to look into. This is like a really pretty nude. Kind of, nah, it's more on the pinky tone. Let's swatch it. Has a nice vanilla scent to it. I'm not into glosses as much. You guys know I love my matte lipsticks, like hands down. Um, but when there's glosses I like, I use them up. But this is a nice little trial size to try out, and that's the color. It is really pretty, actually. It's a lot more pigmented than I thought it would be. So the next thing I have here is from Micah Beauty Cosmetics, and it is a shimmer powder in Harlequin. I'm assuming it's an eyeshadow, and it's sealed, and it looks green, and I'm going to swatch it. Wow, that's sparkly. That's that right there. But it is a really pretty green. It's got kind of like a golden champagne hue to it. Really nice. So I got a sample of the Smashbox Pore Minimizing Primer. I've been dying to try one of the Smashbox primers, but I really just don't feel up to um, buying one. But this is a decent sample. This is the Pore Minimizing Photo Finish Foundation Primer, and it is I don't think you guys can capture that on camera but ooh, this feels thick I like it ooh and the last thing I see here is from Indie Lee brightening cleanser never heard of this brand before and apply a small amount of cleanser to wet face gently massage and rinse face with warm water so it's all natural paraben free cleanser It's got like a, oh my god, I can't, I know the scent. It's like a candy, it feels like a jelly. It smells like candy almost. Of course my favorite item in the bag would be, would have to be the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. And I would give it to the cleanser as well because I'm all about skincare right now. I've had some horrible breakouts so I'm just trying to figure out what works for me and not. So let me know down below what was your favorite item from your Ipsy Glam Bag. Um, and maybe what was not your favorite item. Um, obviously this, I am i don't even know if I want to give this to someone because to me the smell is nauseating. Just thinking about it. I'm just getting, no. My husband didn't like it. My daughter was like, mom, what's that smell? That's a problem. That's a problem. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know about this. Um, does anyone like this? 
uh, Rogue by Rihanna. Rihanna, really, did you even smell this? Did you? But anyway, <laughs> I digress. So that's pretty much it for my October Ipsy Glam Bag. I love the bag. I think it's gorgeous. And I like some of the items in there. I'm just not as impressed. So I'm really debating on even keeping many of my subscriptions. So yeah, I don't know. If you guys know of any new subscriptions that I should give a go, let me know down below. But anyway, I'm going to move along to my next video. So as always, I thank you guys so much for watching. Please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.